Hey, what's up everybody? It's Andrew with Run Guns, and today I'm gonna to show you how to have back straps to a Glock Gen 4 or Gen 5. So first thing you wanna do, you wanna make sure your safety checked. You wanna have an empty gun. Next, what you're gonna do is you wanna remove these back straps so you have access to your multi-tool. So of course you could choose which one you wanna go with. For this example, we'll go with the medium size beaver tail option. So first thing you wanna do is you're gonna to wanna to remove this pin. So you can use the included tool and careful guys, because it is polymer, it's not metal, which probably I'd prefer if it was, because it could bend if you hit it at the wrong angle. So you're gonna push it out. You can see it's coming out the other side. So you'll remove this piece, save that for later. And what you wanna do is add this on. Now make sure you line it up correctly and make sure it kind of snaps in place, especially here up top. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna line it up you heard that clicking, so that's a good sign. Check it out. Looks pretty well lined up. And now if you notice on your multi-tool here, there's also a larger piece. Now these are for the back straps. This is for the no back strap, the small one. So this larger option, what you're gonna do is you're gonna push it in and push it flush and that's it. If you need a little help pushing it in, you could always use a magazine. These come in handy and that gives you your extra bit so there it is flush beaver tail ready to go if you guys like this video like share subscribe thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next one wrg out